Dreamies and welcome back to my channel or if you're new hit the subscribe button and join the family. As you guys can see by today's title we'll be doing a fall shopping vlog slash haul slash basically stuff i just picked up from them from the mall for fall shopping so without further ado let's get right into today's video so the first thing i'm going to do is show you guys me the vlogging process of me buying and getting all the stuff that i have to show you guys today so we'll go ahead and insert that clip now All right, so we're in the mall right now to do a little bit of fall shopping. And y'all see we have a special guest today. Y'all can really see him right there, but y'all saw him in the clips before. But yeah, we're about to go to, I think Beth and Butterworks first, maybe Victoria's Secret. I don't know y'all see right now. The sweet cinnamon pumpkin. Mm. I don't like that at all. Festival. Mm -hmm. I don't know, I don't like that one either. It's not bad, but pumpkin, pecan. <laughs> this isn't bad. I kind of like that. I'm gonna get this one. I have to get used to vlogging in the store, but I'm looking for the one I saw on. Is this it? Okay, fall and bloom, let's see. Burberry, her wear. Actually, it does, it does. Oh my gosh, it does. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is popping this up right now, buy three, get one free. So I get one of the I don't know what this is. Do you wonder? I want to try this again. So I'm thinking about getting the pure wonder. <laughs> oh my gosh, I just dropped everything. Are you over here breaking stuff? No, not on purpose. Breaking. I need to start wearing my bag. Yeah, yes, you, oh, are no. you are on the vlog. Oh, I, I need a video release. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so I, I don't think I like it now. I might get it. I think I already saw this one. Yeah, it smells awful. Pumpkin bonfire. Mm, I don't like this one either. Lano. Mm, this one smells good. I like that one. Mahogany, teakwood, and tint. Oh, I do like it. Mm, this smells good. Yeah, I like the mahogany. <laughs> <laughs> My mama said she don't like it. That is disgusting. Man, I was gonna get it. So we're gonna get the Fallen Bloom and the Mahogany Teak with Intense. Right, right. So they have some cute like candle holders in here, but me, I don't need a candle holder. We're gonna be real ratchet, real ghetto up in here. 
But now we're about to check out before I buy up the store because y'all know how I get when I come to Bath and Body Works. This isn't really fall shopping, so I might not do too much. I might just show y'all what I get out of here. But it is fall, so they should have fall things. It looks like Christmas to me. All right, y'all saw that mess. <laughs> Of me shopping so i did um go to the mall a few days ago and whatever but i wanted to wait to show you guys what i got because one i was looking presentable and two i just wanted to sit down and tell you guys what i got so y'all basically saw what i picked up but i'm going to show you guys right now what i did with my fall shopping so for the fall starting off with the lotions and body mist from bath and body works i did get the set that i was telling you guys about so the one I mentioned in my previous video, the Fall in Bloom, I did get the Fall in Bloom. And what I would say is it does smell like the Burberry hair. So I got the lotion and I got the body spray to match just because I am all about matching my sprays. So let me smell this for you guys on camera. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Definitely like my Burberry hair. And y'all know I do have the Burberry hair. I got it last christmas so and i've been putting it in all my vlogs i've been wearing it very i love it i love it so i'll know it if i smell it and this does smell like the Burberry hair but of course it will not last as long as the actual perfume would last because this is a body mist but if you are looking for a scent close to the Burberry hair i would definitely recommend the fall and bloom by bath and body works so just some other lotions and body mist i picked up from bath and body works for the fall season i do have the sweet cinnamon pumpkin and let's smell this it smells exactly like it's not giving it's giving pumpkin but it's not giving just you know like pumpkin it's giving like a sweet but also kind of a musky scent i don't know how to describe it i think i might have a fragrance like this already and it's just mixed in with pumpkin so some of the fragrance notes are heirloom pumpkin autumn cinnamon ginger snap whipped vanilla and I'm definitely getting that vanilla scent. But it is still giving like spice, pumpkin spice in a sense. I don't eat pumpkins. I haven't had pumpkin spice. I have no clue. But if I was to think of something, it would be pumpkin spice. So yeah, this definitely smells good for the holiday season. I will wear this maybe for Halloween if I do something on that day. I do not know yet, but it is definitely a good scent to have for this fall season. And next up, I did go to the mall previously, maybe about a month ago, like I said in one of my previous videos, and I did smell this. This is the Pure Wonder. And I did smell this while, I, don't mind my nose. I did smell this while I was in the mall that time, and I was like, mm, I just don't like it. Why are the girls going crazy over this? But then I smelled it again, cause I was like, maybe I was chipping that day. Let's give it a second try. I smelled it and I liked it. Bigger snows are iced rose, star jasmine, and warm white amber. So I have heard a lot about the amber or the jasmine, and I like it. Like, I don't know how to describe it. Let me spray it. Mm, I just don't know how to describe it. I don't, <laughs> I'm not wasting any more. But it's, it smells kind of like refreshing, like a refreshing scent. So this is definitely good for the fall season. Uh, I don't recommend wearing this in the summer because it's going to like clash with the sunlight, I feel like. But you know, in the winter, you can smell like stronger scents and it'll smell nicer. And right now I'm smelling it in my room and it's not like strong, but it's not fruity either. So it's more like a, not a woody, but it's more on the woody side, I would say. So I definitely recommend this for the fall season. And the last thing I have with the lotions and the sprays is the whiskey by bath and body works and i just got the lotion i didn't get the spray and with that one i didn't get the lotion because i just feel like i won't wear it like that to get the lotion and all that and this one i feel like i will wear all that to get the spray with just lotion as a base but it smells so good like it smells like my like a mild ysl libre intense or maybe maybe even the regular ysl libre but it kind of smells like that but like more on the mouth side not as strong and to the point where you can smell it if you're walking by 
but this is like a really good scent. The notes are golden amber, vanilla infused whiskey, and sweet red berries. Definitely exactly what it says. It's not woody, but it is like, it puts me into myself like sandwood kind of, but not really though, but it's like, a, it's still a feminine, it's like a feminine sandwood, if you would. That's what it kind of smells like to me, and I'm, I'm liking it. I probably should have got the spray, but I know I won't wear it that much. But this is definitely good for the fall season with like, you know, Christmas and Thanksgiving. You're getting like the fall and autumn feel to everything. And this definitely gives me autumn. So I will definitely be wearing this soon <laughs> for the winter months, the colder season. I just had to get one more. So. All right, still from Bath & Body Works. I did get a couple of candles that you guys saw. So one of the candles was the Fall and Bloom. So I did get, I got the candle, I got the lotion, and I got the spray. Obviously y'all can tell I like it, and I'm not lying when I say it actually does smell like the Burberry Her. The candle smells just like the lotion. You know, sometimes they'll switch it up with the candles, but it smells just like the lotion and the spray. It gives me fall, like a night candle scent, if you see what I'm saying. It's like a day candle scent. But I still love it, and I feel like it'll light up the whole house smelling like this, and this smells really, really good. Mm -hmm. can't wait to crack that open stay tuned for my vlog that's coming so I'm here in a few days but then I also got the mahogany teakwood intense that version of the candle this one is more woody and like not a male scent but it gives you the smell of like a man if you see what I'm saying like a man's cologne but it's not to the point where it's overbearing or it'll make your nose start running because of how intense it is like the name suggests but it is a very good scent, I love it. An intense version of our classic home fragrance with notes of rich mahogany, black tea wood, teak wood, dark oak, and frosted lavender with natural essential oils. It's definitely giving me teak wood. If you guys have ever smelled the teak wood by Bath & Body Works, for the men, it smells really, really good. I think I might've got that last year from my brother for Christmas, that's besides the point, but it smells really, really good. And that's exactly what this puts me in the mindset of. It's giving Christmas, snuggling up, cozy, real nice, maybe a stormy or a snowy night. We don't get snow here in Florida, but I mean, y'all might get snow where you're from, but it's giving like a cold night or whatever. And that's what I love about this scent. And that's why I picked it up. My mom was also there with me. She smelled it, she said she loved it. and. It's, it's a bomb scent. I would definitely get this candle if I were you. I'm just saying. But it smells like a man's cologne. So if you're in the mood to smell a man, I guess, or just like the musky and sandwood or teakwood kind of aroma in the house, I would definitely recommend that. All right, so that's all I got from Bath & Body Works. And I did get a couple new perfumes, as you guys saw in my recap video for my 19th birthday. I did mention these two items that I got for or on my birthday and that I love so much. And it both of them are a false scent to me. Really, one of them is like a year round, but well, both are a year round, they smell similar. But I definitely recommend them. So the first one I'm gonna bring out is the Baccarat Rouge 540. This is how the bottle looks. I got it in the 2.4 ounce bottle and y'all know how expensive this stuff is. I believe they have a smaller one. It might be like a hundred something dollars. This little one, the size that I have it on my other perfumes was already 300 and something dollars, like $309. Crazy. But y'all know the big bottle that's only this big is $900. Who, who's paying for that? I guess y'all are, and I am too. So, but it smells so good. Like I don't have the fragrance notes on here to sweet, tell you guys how it smells, but I have heard, I've seen so many videos of girls or women saying that this scent is lovely, like they love it. They suggest everyone to go get it. But the thing is, it's not available in any of the stores that are in my city. I had to go out of town for this, y'all know. And even there, they didn't let me smell it, like smell it. But I had to just buy it. She said the only way you can tell it is by buying it. But she did say there was something close to it, which we'll get into next, that I could smell. And I smelled that and I loved it. So I was like, oh yeah, well if that smells how this, the Baccarat smells, then I'm going to get the Baccarat. Like, just get it. Everyone says it's good. It's got to be. Following trends. We have a video on that. Do not follow the trends, but I'm glad I did this time. <laughs> so let me smell it for you guys on camera. I'm not wasting none of this. It smells so good. It gives, and this is a unisex scent, so it gives musky and manly, but it's not to the point where it stinks or smells just like a man. Like, I still get that kind of fruity, 
not vanilla but like the fruity soft side of the perfume and i definitely recommend it for the winter months because it'll last for three four days on your clothes like no joke i was putting my clothes in the washer and i still smelled the scent it had been a week not a week but like you know a few days coming from, from vacation i said well dang <laughs> And I wore this on another article of clothing and it had less there a couple days. I forgot what it was I wore, but I wore it just one day and I still smelled it in my closet. I said, how do I smell this in my closet? And I know I washed my shirt or my dress, whatever I wore. That's crazy. But it's such a good scent and it lasts forever. I can understand why it is the price it is because it'll last and it smells very good. I definitely, definitely recommend this for the colder days if you're on a date night. It's giving date night work. If you're feeling classy at work or you got a office job or you want people to smell you, this is definitely what you want to wear to work. People will compliment you all day. I got compliments wearing this and I love it. So the one I was saying was the closest to the Baccarat Rouge 540 is the Oula Rouge. And it's funny they have like a similar name, but this is the 3.4 fluid ounce bottle. And it does smell similar to the Baccarat, but this one is a little bit more sweet. And as you can see, I have been spraying this one a lot. Partially because I don't want to keep spraying this one and, you know, have to buy another $300, but it's worth it. But this one was only like $100, but it still smells so good. It lasts my clothes all day. It doesn't last as long, like, you know, days on, like the Baccarat, of course. But it still is a good scent to last all day. It smells so good. I love it. It's definitely a winter scent, just like that one. You could wear it to work, to date night or you know where if even if you're just you like to wear perfume to sleep or you know just perfume around the house is definitely good for that i wouldn't suggest that for around the house but that's that's y'all <laughs> but this one i love so much and look at the design it's so cute like what is that i don't know it's it, but it's so cute i love flowers and i love red so this is just perfect and i love dresses and that's exactly what it gives me like a dress kind of feel but it's not as musky it is a little bit more on the sweet side rather uh, compared to the baccarat 540 but i love both of them equally so yeah and that's what i got for the perfumes and the sprays now in the video i don't think i have like a i included like clips of me and victoria's secret but i didn't really record too much because i didn't want, want them to think i was stealing <laughs> Uh, I didn't want them to think I was stealing. Like, I have the money, I promise. But they did have a sale going on for like seven panties for $35. So I got that. But I also had coupons for, I don't know if I showed you guys that in the video, but one free panty or 30% off your whole purchase. Something like that. So I'm just going to show you guys quickly what I got. I know y'all don't want to see this, but I'm sure y'all anyway, because they're just too cute not to show. And it's still fall shopping. So if you don't want to see this part, <laughs> Click the video. Thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. But for everyone else, girl, bye. Girl, bye. This one isn't really fall, but look at the, I feel like deep dark colors are fall. Very cute for the fall. Now this one, I know I just said deep and dark, but baby, it was too cute. And I just like pink. So y'all know we like pink over here. So I got this, so cute. Then I was like, did I get the same thing twice? No, it's just a deep dark color. These are just regular, like, I also like regular ones. I don't gotta dress it up. So I just love the color as you guys can see. So I was like, did I get the same thing twice? No, this one just has like a band on it. <laughs> it's basically the same thing, just with a band. Same color and all that. But they're both so cute and comfortable. Then I got this purple thing. Yeah, yeah, frilly, cute. It could be fall, could be fall. I mean, you know, I don't know. <laughs> and back to pink y'all can see i really have like a lot of pinks purples colors like that for the fall but that's just because i like pink like <laughs> sorry so i got this super cute love the color love the design it's just one victoria's secret in the front then this one was just random because i feel like throwing some weird designs in there because why not so got that and then i just got another deep purple maybe i'm on my purple chin right now but it's also for like the fall like i see purple a lot like the leaves don't turn purple but they turn like a dark brown i don't know it just puts me in a set of the mindset of fall so got these and my last ones just some regular 
gray just regular on a day-to-day -day basis that i will wear these or whatever but yeah that's it for my victoria secret so that's it for today's video if you guys enjoyed it comment like and subscribe if you're gonna try out any of this scents or have any of this scents please comment that down below and tell me how you like it or what you don't like about it uh just give me your opinions or whatever but that's it for today's video and i'll see you guys in my next voltober post bye